Hello and welcome to Minish Cap. We're gonna do some more fusing. This time back at the grave site we were at. Ooh, where's the graveyard? It's over here. Why am I going that way? Come on, dude. The ladder to and fro to the graveyard we shall go getting licked by many more ghosts hopefully not I said it too soon oh man I didn't know those birds knocked my freaking coins out stupid birds knocking my coins that are rupees Alrighty, let's go! Which way? Left? Up? Left? Up? Right? No, I think I've done it wrong already. <laughs> no, man. I thought I memorized it. Whoops, now I can't rememorize it because... Maybe it was up? Mm, we're definitely off. Left. So it's up left. Left. Up. Right. Up. Yeah, that's it. Alrighty. Heart. So we're going to fuse with this lady here. I guess maybe not a lady? I don't know. It looks like a lady to me. Oh, stop licking me. Yes, let's fuse kinstones. Blue ones, in fact. Now this does this. This is a dumb thing. It's just like a gambling game where you have a 50-50 chance of getting a chest. And then if you do this fuse with this girl, it makes it more risky, but you get more reward if you win. I don't recommend it. You, I mean, I have 999 rupees in my practice game. And I have 809 rupees in this. I don't think you need rupees. I'm not wanting for rupees. So we could have actually fused that with that ghost last time we were here. And then afterwards, you can fuse again with her. And now let's fuse with Dompe. He also wants that same blue piece. He will open a grave up there. Huh? They fit. Yes, Dompe. They fit. So let's go inside. And we can fuse with this pink ghost if we want to. It's a green fusion, so it's just a random item. It's probably rupees. And this opens 
a waterfall in Harmontown! Yes, I know where that is. Did perfectly! Then we can open this for a hundred mysterious shells that are useless to me because I'm not doing the shell quest. But if you are, then you'll know how to get some. Now let's go over here, back over here, and fuse with this person again. This time, it fuse makes this ghost here have a revelation. I don't know why I've been such a nasty little prankster all the time. All of a sudden, I feel like a weight's been lifted off my shoulders. I feel like I've made up for all the awful deeds. <laughs> See you in paradise. Whee! And that's in a Agnes's, or Andrew's house. They fit perfectly. I have a good feeling about this. Alright, so now we can warp back to Hyrule Town and take care of this stuff that we just got. Also, the teacher left the front of this building. I don't know what we're trying to do here. My guide hasn't told me anything about this. Yeah, even though we can technically do this right now. Recess is almost over! Well, these kids aren't on recess. I like reading books. I get to pretend I'm the hero and run around having adventures and stuff. Oh, this guy wants to confuse with me. He made a chuck appear in North Hyrule. They fit perfectly. Oh, good. Oh, is he also on? I couldn't tell if that was his snot bubble or if he wanted to... No, don't blow the whistle. I'm trying to talk to this lady. The children are on their lunch recess. Playing is as important as studying. After all, a healthy body leads to a healthy mind. Yeah, but those kids aren't. I did see some places up here to go. We could go over here, no. I thought I saw an area we could get to. Maybe I'm thinking of that and you just can't do it. How though? Why? Maybe you have to go someplace else in here. Ah, there it is. Trick me. Yellow is a rare color for us, Minish. There's a good side and a bad side to being rare. Two yellow only. Two yellow ones rarely ever show up in the same place, so they never meet. So, do I have to make two show up in the same place? We got a red Kenstone piece. So, I was playing Breath of the Wild. I'm playing Breath of the Wild right now, just for fun. And having played through all of these... Zelda games without having getting to use motion controls and stuff... My food is coming up, I think. Yay, yay! I think this guy fuses with you. You can get him to stand still long enough. Oh, I'm not finishing my thought. As I was saying, I started to play Breath of the Wild, and having not been able to use motion controls on the Zelda games that I'm playing here, and having to press R to do things in this game, was very confusing to me. I kept pressing B to use my sword, because that's the sword in every Zelda game, but it's X in the Breath of the Wild. And then I've been aiming with the control stick. 
which I used to hate using. And then I kept pressing R to do stuff, because this game you press R to do stuff. Huh? This flower bed looks a little strange. You have to turn the flower beds out back too. What's the point of this? The school is nothing. Maybe that's why the guy that said didn't tell me to go in here, because it's useless. Just like that. Game of chance. Anyways, let's go inside Andrew's house now that the ghost has moved away from the entrance as a minish. Go in the purple house. I'm gonna have so much trouble remembering. Hmm, when on the practice file, I could fuse with the dog. Did we already do that in this one? Maybe. I don't remember that. And now these chicks will hurt you, so be careful. Oh, it already hurt me. Get out of my way! I want to go to the chimney and then fuse with this chicken? Why can't I do it? That's so weird. Uh, I never fused with this chicken. So... It's weird. Whatever, it's just a green fusion anyway, it doesn't matter. That guy is weird! The dog didn't fuse with me and the chicken, and I was able to do that in the practice file, and obviously I haven't done it before because that ghost was in the way. I don't know what's going on. Alright, well, that was a bust. So let us go now to see Nehru, Din, and the rest. And fuse of them. Yay, a red kinstone piece is fused with Nehru! And that makes in the graveyard, which we're gonna have to go back to again, a butterfly appear. Now we can go visit Nehru. I mean, Din? No. Ferrari. Go visit Ferrari in the inn and fuse with her. And that makes a butterfly appear in Caster Wilds. Now we can also explore the inn, I guess, a little bit. And this guy won't talk to us until after we do this. So, now that we have a light source, we can light these lights. And that gives us access to the balcony, which we can get a red kinstone piece from. We can also go downstairs to where the inn actually is. And we can talk. We can, like, rent a room. I don't know what it does. I'm guessing it just heals you? But, oh yeah. I didn't do it, and I don't plan on doing it this way, just unless the guy tells me it's something important. I feel like I don't want to waste my roops. Weird, this is weird. Why are people not wanting to fuse with me? I wonder if it's just because... I've already gotten... I wonder if there's just random people that confuse with you. Like, if you talk to him, he asks if you stayed in the rooms, if you've tried the other rooms, and then I was able to fuse with him. That's weird. It must just be that there's random people that fuse with you, and if you haven't fused with everyone randomly that you can, then... I don't know. Because the green ones are just random. Like, I was getting ones from people in the practice file that I've already gotten. In this ver in this playthrough. Maybe just a certain amount of people will fuse with you and then it's just random who it is. I don't know. Alright, but we need to catch Din, because the green ones are random, but the red ones are not. I feel like the blue ones are not, but they're not important. The red ones are important. 
I mean, the gold ones are obviously important. And now we can talk to Din. And we'll fuse kinstones with her. Each one wants a different one. A different patterned one. And this makes a butterfly appear in the Wind Ruins. Yay, a perfect match! Well, since we're already here... We may as well go... I mean, we're up here already, so we may as well go to the closest butterfly that appeared. Which is back in the graveyard. So maybe I'll meet you there, since we don't need to meet it. Go over there again. Oh, wait. One of the kinstone pieces made a chest appear here, and it's 200 with shells. Alrighty, here we are in the Royal Valley. And up over here, I believe it is? Or no, it was by the graves, so we have to go over to the Royal Crypt. And there's the butterfly, we have to capture it. And now we got a joy butterfly. Now we can swim faster than we could before. These butterflies just do random things. I mean, they're not random. They're each, it does the same thing every time. But each one gives you a special ability. And the other two are by the wind crest. We caught a joy butterfly. We can now shoot at arrows faster than we could before. Woohoo! I believe the butterfly is. Oh, I hate these snakes. We caught a joy butterfly. We can dig faster than we could before. So cool now. We're so awesome. All right. Where was that other chest? Wasn't there another kinstone piece that appeared somewhere? Oh, I know where it is. It happens to be where we're going next anyway, so let's do it. Next, we're going to go over to Hyrule. Whoops! We're going to go to Hyrule Castle Gardens, and we are going to talk to... this man. He wants to fuse kinstones with us, I believe. Whoops! And a red one at that, which means it's the same every time, and it's a good thing. And this one opens up a waterfall at Veil vale Falls. They fit perfectly. A strange power within my bones eats my own bones to bits. Okay, and the next thing we're gonna do is get that kinstone piece thing, but to do that we have to do this stupid guard puzzle again. Art. Mm, it's not even good. I think it's just a fairy fountain, so I'm not even going to do it. If you could pass by the guard thing and get to this stupid fountain up here that was drained, it's just fairies. It's pointless for me to go through all the trouble. Anyways, we'll go to Vale Falls next because that's where the kinstone piece opened the waterfall. A 
believe it's the one over here. And this is another dojo where we learn another move. The spirit and sword are one. I am the nearly best swordsman in Hyrule Split Blade. If you train with me, you will discover the secrets of your hidden powers. So, would you like to train here? Please, sir. Mm, now I will teach you how to fill your split gauge faster than ever. I take visualization training very seriously, I'll have you know. Now quietly close your eyes. Visualize your body splitting even faster than ever before. Splitting! Now you will fill your split gauge much faster, my student. This is the truth of the sword, and truth is almost the exact opposite of not truth. Commit yourself to the blade! This is a dumb idea. Instead of making these people dojo things, they should have made these people like magicians that cast powers on you because you're not really learning how to do anything. For the, this instance, you're just being able to split your blade faster. It's, it's more... It should have just been fairies like in Ocarina of Time where they bestow gifts upon you like magic meters and stuff. Oh my goodness. Alright, so... We're gonna go up to the next area, I think, and then I'm gonna call it an app. Now, the piece that Gustav gave us in his grave is gonna be coming up. And that's also in Vale Falls, but it's on the other side of Vale Falls, not on the one where you get you get to from Lon Lon Ranch. I mean they're both the same, Vale Falls, just one is... Can't access this area from that side, so... I have to go through this way up in North Hyrule Field, and... Ooh, get rid of those crows. Now, we can go across the bridge and fuse with the door here. He wants a gold fusion, and we absolutely have that. The kinstone pieces fit perfectly, maybe something good will happen. I'm pretty sure I know what a door will do if I give it a kinstone piece. It will open, most likely. And I am correct. A stone door! So, this is what they meant by all that source of the flow business. Well, this waterfall certainly is the source of all Hyrule's water. According to King Gustav, the final element lies somewhere behind the falls. We've dawdled long enough, Paul. Let's go find that element. And we will do that, but... Uh, first we'll get bombed by this stupid thing. Can we suck this thing up? Like, how do we get rid of these guys? We're too far. They just, like... Shoot... Bombs at their butts. <sighs> I'm gonna have to pause it. We will continue next time where we go inside that door. Please remember to like the video, subscribe to the... F no, that's not how it goes. Please remember to like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and ring that bell to be notified of future videos, and then the next episode we will continue our journey up the waterfall of... Veil Falls. See you then. Bye!